Alright, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Rejuvenation. Today we're going to be uh, taking out, finding these uh, grunts down here in the cold storage. Uh, let's just get to it. Not much else to do. Hello. Don't thrash the place. Uh, no promises. No promises. So there's, uh, you're, what you're looking for are basically these little um, entrances over here that you can go in uh, and uh, at this point this operation's a bust but I'm not giving up gotta get the goods to our client yeah so uh, a bunch of grunts that you'll have to battle you got a lava plume so lava plume is a bit weaker on this field just because it's you know aha uh -huh. you need three numbers combination to get the goods in the back in exchange for the first number please give me a break with the present time okay the first number of the code is six that's all I'm willing to give. Sure. How about you? Nah, you don't do anything. That's fine. So yeah, there's this uh, going to the other side there. This butterfly does heal you. Unless you have negative karma, then it doesn't. Uh, yep, can't go that way. But I can come over here. Oh. Get an ice heal. Hi there. So yeah, come in here, gotcha cornered. Listen, all I'm saying is that we can do this the hard way or the easy way. I've always wanted to say that. Then we're doing it the hard way, brother. I am not your brother. Okay, so toxicity comes out. Uh, I'm just still gonna allow a plume. I'm gonna shift gear, which is fine. I'm gonna, oh, that's gonna hurt. Okay, yep. Boom burst boosted. It can't be. This was our big break. Big break? What do you mean? When this region was nothing but scrap, we was on top. And then the place got cleaned up and we were swept into rock like this. Our operation was going to bring our name back into the light. Strike fear into the hearts of people of the region again. Right. Sorry. Forgot I didn't give a shit. You couldn't tell us what we need to know or so Viper is going to have some fun getting to know your blood vessels. All right, all right. I'll give you a piece of the code you need to get to the back room. Just leave me alone. Give us the full code. I don't know it. All of us only know one digit so that it takes all of us to get to the goods. Sure, sure. So third is three. So it's six blank three. Yeah, I mean, good try, man. But, you know, it was never going to happen. Uh, heal you up. So now we're going to go over to the other side here. Hi, Melia. Ah, I said it before, but I really hate the cold. I didn't mind it before, but after dealing with Angie, just no. Uh-huh. All right, sure. All right, what do we have to work here? I don't know how you kids got past the guys upstairs, but this operation for months, we won't dare lose it to you all in a mere matter of seconds. Operation for months, you say? Just who are you people? Who are you working for, and why? As if we're gonna give up that information. I'm gonna knock you two kids out with an iron pipe, and that'll be it. Uh-huh. Well, good try. Uh, so level 72 is actually kind of really strong. Oh, it, uh... Okay. It had rock head. Double-edged in KO. That power is nuts. Wait, you two. I've heard about you two. You're those kids that faced that Team Zen thing down in Terrajuma. I saw it on Gear News. So then you know Thumbs and I aren't going to let you let this go lightly, right? <sighs> Don't get me started. You did get away with defeating Team Zen, yeah. But I was a bot's job. I heard a girl died because of it. Struck a chord, didn't I? You guys are weak. But I know I'm unbeaten. I'll give you a piece of the code. It's the only digit I know, so don't ask for more. Four. Got that? Yeah, got it. Come on, that was a low blow, man. That was a low blow. Uh, so we have six, four, three. I'm going to heal up again real quick. But yep, we can just cross over now. Uh-huh, sure. Six, four, three. Nice going. Oh. Round up the guys and we'll lead you inside, okay? Sure, sure. Okay, I think we made it to the end. Maybe. These guys churn out to Tita Gruel, am I right? 
Uh, something like that. The way these guys are acting and talking, I have a feeling this has nothing to do with what we are looking for. Your sources said we'd find a lead on this investigation, right? And to be clear, the one about the missing students and the people turning into stone? Oh my gosh, you're like so serious all the time. Lady, you have no idea who you're talking about. All I want to know if this, all of this was for something or not, that's it. Well, it's definitely for something. Okay, this is doomed. Melia thumbs back me up here. Tell me I'm not going insane. Melia? Uh, yeah, the, the thug kind of hit her with a low blow. Oh, huh? Sorry, something one of those guys that just has me feeling a bit defeated. Suddenly lost all motivation to exist? It's gonna be okay. I'll kick their ass. Okay, while you two are kissing and being weird, I'm gonna go ahead and make some moves. I'm gonna enjoy this. Huh? What's with this piece of paper? Hey, Risa Raider, up here. Eh? You wanna know why we're up to so bad? Then check this chick. Take on a full blast from GDC's past. Oh, shh. Uh, I think I'm okay. That explosion came from the room Risa went in. No way, did Risa fall for a trap or something? That would mean Risa is a okay. But uh, how? Oh, sweetie, it's gonna take a lot more than some explosion to take me down. I may have fallen for a trap, but at least I learned what's going on here, which is... It seems like the people down here created explosive for some nefarious re reason. And they showed me the way to their mechanism work and expect me to just fall over and die. But not this queen. How does that bomb work then? Looks like there's a ton of smaller bombs that are scattered around. Then there are two large balls and when the two balls touch, an explosion happens. Uh-huh. Right, yeah. Uh-huh. You and I need to have a little talk. Yeah. Good luck, Venom. Yeah, a lot of things. So, anyways. So it turns out this lead was hella wrong, but that's okay. Because we learned that there's an actual attempt of actual terrorism in the city. Oh no. Oh yeah, I also found this piece of paper. Managed to pick it up right before that bomb went off. You can take it. Uh-huh. Sure. So yeah, we could still go back down there. Um... There's not much else down here, though. I'm just gonna recheck, uh... There's a couple of frost lasses. They don't battle you, but... They're there. Um... But yeah, all the thugs are now gone. And the door is locked again, so... Not much here aside if you want to actually activate that flower. Uh, flower. Butterfly. But, I mean, you don't really get anything from it. I'm just gonna leave it as a heal spot, just in case. Uh-huh. So yeah, this guy is kind of bugged. He won't interact with you, but yeah, it's okay. Uh-huh. Sure. Anyways, uh, with that being said, well, this had nothing to do with any missing children or people getting turned to stone, but I'd like to think we actually did find something of use. Why were those guys working with explosive? Who is their boss? No idea, but the city's probably going to go under high alert until some questions are answered. I was careless. There was more to explore down there, but the path got caved in from explosion. Oh well, we'll just have to try next harder next time, besties. Hey, Risa, did my intel come in handy for you? Oh hey, no, it was shit. But we did find some other things I'll let you in on a later time. Let me introduce you to some of my friends here. Everyone, this is one of my besties, Va uh, Valerie? Uh huh? Oh, so you've heard of me. Guess my work is doing well. Oh, what are you talking about? We're already acquainted. Don't you remember us? O what? Venom? Thumbs, Melia, come on. I'm not crazy, right? This is Valerie that was in Terajuma. You're right. Oh gosh, it does look a lot like her, and they even have the same name. What's going on here? Uh, I know, as your roommates. They're acting totes crazy. We're the ones acting crazy? Look, I don't know if you guys are mistaking me for someone else or what. 
but I've never interacted with you before today. I'm just a reporter for the GDC paper. That's all. Yeah, and we've been friends for years, so I think you guys just have the wrong gal. I'm I'm telling you, we don't have the wrong gal. I know for a fact this girl's the same Valerie. Venom, you need to calm down. You're freaking her out here. Yeah, freaked out is an understatement. I'll call you later, Reese. I need to leave. What the heck, guys? Dogging my bestie like that was not cool. You need to learn some control. Is everyone in this city freaking insane? Everything's been turned on its head and everyone is acting like nothing is happening. If this is how you're gonna act, then you should just pack your things and head home, queen. This is the big city. If you can't handle it, it'll shoo you up and spit you out. And just between all of us, it's chewing you up real hard right now. Sorry, Rhodes. I would have liked to hang out a little longer, but this kind of killed the mood. No worries. TTYL. I'm not crazy. It's not about you being crazy or not. We just have to keep a level head, yeah? Clearly some weird things are going on. We just need to work to uncover the real truth here. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I'm gonna head to a cafe and eat my heart out. And they're gone. That was awkward. Uh-huh, it seems like Lavender, Hugh, and Cannon are still doing their investigation. Why don't you head up to the Botanical Garden? Sure. So yeah, we'll need to also help out with uh, the other area of investigation. So we can just head up here to the Botanical Garden and the... Uh... Oh, hi, Lavender. I already explained my situation. I'm sorry, but I'm just not comfortable with hosting any gym battles at the moment. You're a gym leader. It's literally your job to host matches no matter what the circumstances. I'm aware, but... Huh? What? You're gonna have to wait for your turn to battle with Lavender. I got here first and I deserve it. If you won't leave, I'm just gonna make you half. I'm just gonna make you. Sure, sure. Um, this is a okay matchup, I think. I just boom burst. Okay, head smash was not expected. Ops the good. I'm gonna switch... If I have a fighting type, this is really great, but uh, I think Gil is fine. I think the first impression is really good. Uh, okay, uh, we're gonna have to go to Prissy here. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not great against flying types. Okay, this is fine. Um, they have a lot of physicals, so I'm just gonna asset armor actually. I'm gonna protect. Oh, it has final gambit. Does that KO? Almost KOs. Okay. Out comes Obstacle and it's gonna taunt. It is faster than me, so that's nice. Uh, I'm gonna switch. Actually, no. I, I think I survived a double edge. Oh, I don't survive a crit. Um, okay, Ellie. Okay. D double crit there was... Not fun. My champ comes out. Uh, oh yeah, I don't survive. Okay, that's fine. Expanding force should be enough. Oh, it's not. I don't have psychic terrain up. There we go. Are you serious? Now you have to go heal my Pokemon. Who even are you? What a stupid name. You haven't missed me, but my friends are gonna beat you down for embarrassing me. Guys, just leave Lavender alone. She's been through enough. Thanks for backing me up, there, guys. No problem, we're all going so some, through some tough times right now. The least the old jerks can do is give you some space, but I guess not. Hey, are you okay? Yeah, there were just some jerks who wouldn't leave me alone. Thankfully, Thumbs and Florin were there to help me out of it. Guess the gang's all here then. I'll unlock the door for you all. If you find anything, well, let me know, please. You can count on us to solve this, don't worry. Yeah. Ahem, Thumbs and Cannon, was it? I'm truly f sorry for how I acted earlier, truly. I've been all out of sorts with what's been going on and I... No problem. Talon was my mentor. I looked up to him. I'm not from Avium natively. I only got here because I got a scholarship for Axis High. When I got here, I was basically alone. I came to the Botanical Garden to isolate myself even more. But Talon found me and made me feel welcome. He's also the reason I met Hugh and all the others. If it weren't for him, I feel like it would still be lost. So when I saw him turn to stone, I just kind of shut down. Who would do that to him? That's why we're here, ma'am. 
Instead of sitting around and moping over what's lost, let's find what has been bringing hidden and bring Talon justice. I think that's what he would want, no? Yes, you are very much right. We can bring Talon justice. And I bet we can find a clue if we investigate his house. Yes, let's go and get started then. Let's do that after I heal up. Um, I'm not sure if Double Edge would have KO'd me without a crit there. But, oh well, whatever. Crits happen. It's just kind of part of Pokemon. Getting double critted is also not ideal. But it's fine. Hey, this place is so quiet now. When Talon was here, he'd always have someone new in here. He was completely obsessed with teaching people about his birds. So that aside, where do we begin? Let's see. Talon lives on the top floor so that he can have access to the balcony. But uh, huh? The ladder leading to his room seems to have been put up. That's weird. Why is that weird? He has Pokemon that can fly, yes? My hypothesis was that he last exited through that way. But Talon always had his ladder down, no matter what. Is it hard to believe that it was put up for a moment of privacy? That's the entire point, actually. The implications of the ladder being up gives it a lot of information. But for now, let's see if we can bring the ladder back down. Sure, um, so we can talk to a few people here. Uh-huh. Yeah, we have no Salamence. Uh, I guess technically Ellie and Buzz are kind of levitating. Nope, head's empty. Okay. Sorry, I was getting a little emotional. I shouldn't be getting emotional when I'm actively trying to bring Talon justice. It's just a little hard. I'll keep looking around. Sure. So we'll just keep looking around. So this here's Florin's room. Not too much here. But uh, there's Flora's room here. Health of plants and stuff like that. There's a gardening journal. The hydrangeas are effed. Grub and got to the roots and cut them up. Sure. Uh-huh. All about ferrothorn sticks out. A strange green box. Uh, well, she's in jail, so... It seems to have a logo from the Terrajuma Weather Institute. Aha. Uh -huh. To Flora. Oh, we got a puzzle box. Um, but we have to go back to Terrajuma to, you know, use it. So, unfortunately, not much here. I can't find anything that will bring the ladder down. No button, no anything. Maybe it's not even possible to do it from down here. I vaguely recall telling Florin there was a secret way to enter his room if the need arose. So I'm sure there's a way, we just need to find it. Or Talon himself could tell us how to do it. Lavender, you don't mean... Yes, Huey. It's still not perfected, but maybe I'll work here? I don't follow. How do I explain this? There's... There exists an invisible plane of... Uh, there exists an invisible plane of existence that houses data of people. Wherever someone le visits or leaves an area, they leave behind a metaphysical footprint. Basically, a trace that you were there. The same way a website can log your visit in its database and keep it there. It knows what you did, how long you visited, and what, and when you left. I'm sorry, but I don't understand how this is going to help us. Okay then, I'll just show you. And it, again, please bear in mind that this is in its testing phase. I haven't gotten anywhere close to perfecting this, so it may come with some uh, quirks. Let's link up. Holy crap, I can't believe it actually worked. Lavender, what the? Everyone, welcome to the metaphysical plane of existence. Theoretically metaphysical anyway. So we're in a totally different dimension? No, we're still in Talon's home. It's just a mental projection Alkazam has brought us to. In reality, we're standing around like zombies while the real world, while our minds are active here. Perhaps I should have sat everyone down first before I did this. Where's Cannon? Cannon's consciousness was not brought with us? That's strange. I did say this was in its testing stages. We need to work fast. Uh-huh. Shep. Okay. So yeah, we'll interact with different objects and see, uh, basically historical artifacts. Looks like we're ready to go, mate. Yeah, I was just getting a few things I'm gonna need. I think you'd pa already pack those away. Or perhaps it's something that'll make your sister cancel last minute. I think that'll be nice. 
I know you and Flora don't get along that well, but can you please just make the effort? Mate, your sister is the one that lacks the effort. Get, just gets right under my skin, she does. That brooding personality is doing nothing for her, I tell you. I mean, yeah. I've seen dull rock types with better personality than hers. They were actually fun to be around. Okay, okay, I understand. Just give me a bit and I'll be right up. How about this one? The roots here look like they're diseased. At this rate, it won't be long until the whole plant dies. That's what I've been saying. We need to uproot this thing so and can it before it spreads its disease through the other roots. Once that happens, it's over for the garden. Uh, uprooting plant takes forever to do. We can try that move we've been working on. You mean the very fittingly named special move, Uproot? What the hell would, uh, else would I be talking about? We've designed that move specifically for this, and I know it's given us mis mixed results, but... Gotta put through its testing phase at some point. I'm concerned that the move is too powerful and will cause damage to the other plants. What about testing phases flying over your head? If you're too scared, then try to stay out of the way and let me handle it. And one more. Are we still up for our expedition to Terajuma, Talon? You got it, mate. There's still places on that wild island that I haven't even begun to explore. My maps will be a huge help to those native to the island, for fellow adventurers as well. So what's our first point we're visiting? There are ruins that we haven't been through and explored yet, presumably because the Pokemon in that place are known to be quite dangerous. But who knows what's hidden away in that place? Treasure? I uh, know, but I'm sure it'll be fun as long as you're here. So yeah, uh, nothing great. Nope. Uh... Oh, uh, excuse me, but this is a private residence. You do not own this house, child. Do not speak of private residences to me. What is it that you want? The appearance of you all marks... You all marks the beginning of the end. Thumbs. Your investigation is moot. Without power, skill, or dedication, all will be lost to you. And so he'll just randomly challenge us to a battle. Um, now this is a difficult one, for sure. Oh, we burned it. That's perfect. Oh. That is so good. Shadow Sneak doesn't KO us now. But yeah, his level is 74, so that is strong. I'm gonna nuzzle, actually, because I am a little afraid. Okay, never mind. We KO it. Uh, so yeah, uh, that Aegislash can be a huge threat. Um, as you can see, it, it autonomized. Uh, so yeah, Shadow Sneak is a big threat. Um, but yeah, if you have a like, strong fire type, that KOs both of them pretty nicely. Ground types also work well. He has both steel types, so um, very formidable. I am impressed by these results. You will do well to keep yourself on this path, Thumbs. There will be a time the true face of hell will make itself known to you. I hope you are ready to fight for your life when it comes to it. Did you come here just to bore us with some common sense speech? Mm, you have more of a mouth than I remember, dear child. This is what happens to those who lose their will to fight. Their purpose is lost, and as a result, they lose all their sense of decency. A former shell of a person, I once was in that spot, but I found a true purpose now. Dreaming a dream so grand that it becomes a nightmare. Also, when you return to the metaphysical plane, tell a lavender to have her Alakazam filter out everything but the feelings of dread. You will find your answers then. Now, I don't find myself to be the one to jump to conclusions, but I would like to declare that encounter as incredibly suspicious. No, uh, you don't say, Canon. Anyways, yeah, uh, I accidentally pressed um, X there, so that kind of skipped a bunch of message, but he, we basically just explained to Canon what's happening. Um, yep. Yeah, so uh, Canon for some reason is not able to come here. I had to fight off a weird masked individual. Um, yeah. This whole process is my thesis project for Access High, remember? So that means that my research is public knowledge. Anyone can look me up and find out what I'm studying, although that doesn't matter right now. That person said Alakazam should filter out everything except for a feeling of dread? Hmm, worth a try. 
Yep. So, uh, new artifacts. So, there's one there. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's the only one, so... Talon? Is something wrong? Florin, not now, mate. Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. N no, it's not your fault. It's mine. Lost my temper there for a sec. Can't believe I'm that weak. Huh, that's losing your temper? Compared to Flora, that's nothing. Ah. Uh, must have forgotten to put down the ladder to my room. I flew out in such a hurry this morning. Didn't even get a get a whole bite of brekky. Well, that's no problem for you, right? You can just fly on up there and you'll be good. For once, mate, I'm not in the mood to fly anywhere. What did you just do? Every adventurer has a plan B, silly. Sometimes things don't pan out the way you want them to. You must always be prepared for this outcome. Yep, we found it. Alright, uh, let's get up there. That took a lot more effort, but we found our way up here. I've known Talon for a long time, but I've never been up here before. It's pretty cool. He always had treats for my Flareon. Maybe I can find some in here. Huey, I don't think this is the time. Oh, you're right. Sorry. What's this? No way. Did you find something? Did I ever? This letter in the red envelope. It's from Talon's mother. What'd she say? My dearest Talon, I hope you are well. It's been some time since we've seen each other last. Being apart from family has made my heart weary and beaten. I am writing you this letter to tell you that I've decided to visit you in Grand Dream City. Please meet me at Club Nightlight tonight at 11.30. Your dearest mother. Ah, huh? Club Nightlight? That's a choice for a spot to meet up. The pieces are starting to come together now. This letter is suspicious. That much is apparent, but in what way? The person who wrote this letter couldn't have been Talon's mother. Because Talon's mother is bedbound. She can't travel. Oh, I never knew. I knew this because Talon told me one day when we were having tea. Talon must have read this letter and went to go see who was impersonating his mother. But he didn't want anyone to know where he was going, so he flew off his balcony. And perhaps that's why his ladder was still up the day he was found. Pulling it up would be equivalent of closing the door at night before you slept. He never returned to set it back down in the following morning. I'm going to club nightlight. What do you expect to find at this club? I don't know, but it's the only lead we have right now. Um, that place is kind of hard to get into these days. If we want to be let in, we should go right now. Okay. Will you be traveling with us? Sure, we'll just do this right now. So yeah, the club night light is through here, which is, uh... As you can see, pretty crowded. Seems like this club is quite popular during the day. There's no way we'll be able to make it in right now. Yep, so we'll be for it'll be forced to be nighttime until you finish this next little section. I'm just gonna do so, it's okay. Um Once it's nighttime we can actually head in. Hey, this place is kinda not bumping. Usually this place is packed. Are we sure this special guest is set to appear at 1130? I have no idea. I've never set foot in here before tonight. And truthfully, I'm a bit uncomfortable by it. I'm gonna go ask an employee. So, what time is it right now? Uh, 9.45. Right. This club closes at 10.30. There is no special guest at 11.30. Oh, what? Well, that's not what the letter said. I think the employee got it wrong. Huey, I think it's more likely to whoever wrote the letter was lying. Yeah, I know, I know. I was just testing you guys. In any case, that would explain why this sham of a club is empty. It's about to close in a little over half hour. Sham, you bet you kids better not be talking about my club. You own this establishment? That's right, baby. I'm the proud owner of Club Nightlight. Just call me Adam Might. I'm hot, I'm on top, and everybody loves me. Everybody, huh? Hmm, have you met before? Let me take a good look at you. Hmm, wait a second. I do know you. You're that little town hero. What's your name again? Willow? Well, the name you got? Whoa, sorry. Didn't know that name a lot to you. Well, anyway. I don't think we've met before. It's almost insulting that you're confusing me with someone else, you know? I'm one of a kind. It's just who is it that's trying to copy my style? Uh, so yeah. You are Adam. Very different from the Adam we knew. 
beats me. I've never seen you before in my life. Uh -huh. I knew it was a mistake. Don't make that mistake again, though. Wait a minute. You kids are over the age of 18, right? Yes. Ah, oh, phew. Dodge a bullet there, eh? Well, you kids take it easy. Thanks for coming. Bizarre. Well, this was a bust then. We won't learn anything just from being here. We're going to use Abakazam's help once again and look for any traces of Talon being here. Let's do this. Why do I feel like I'm going to be left out again? And indeed, uh, Canon, um... It's okay, Alakazam. We just need to fix a few of the cracks in our process and we should be good to go. So yeah, uh, Canon not being here is really, really cool in terms of, like, if you know, you know aspect. So cool. There seems to be only a single artifact available. Talon never came here before that letter, so that adds up. Should be easy. So you say, should be easy. Well, let's interact. Alright, come out with it then. Where are you? I know you're here, and I know you're impersonating my mother. I'm not interested in that letter's contents. I just want to know why. Why would you stoop so low to hurt me like this? What have I ever done to you? Wait, it can't be. Mother? My darling boy. I don't understand. You should be at home resting. How are you able to come all the way here on your own? My darling boy, you are so stupid. I don't understand. What was that about? Why would Talon's mother say something so cruel? Was that all? Seems so. Let's wake up and return back to consciousness. Party people, we've got a special surprise guest for you all. Give it up for Reese, our raider. Crap, this is bad. Alakazam uses the energy of the amount of people in the room to recreate its space. If this venue is filled up while Alakazam is channeling the li- Zam? Hey, Alakazam, it's okay, calm down. D-Link, D-Link! Um, yep. Uh, Lavender is being tossed around. Alakazam's in mind going ha haywire. Uh... Okay. Okay, so, uh, that's a thing. Um, so. We do need to get through this. Um, battling is going to be a big thing. I'm gonna Boom Burst. Boom Burst should be one-shotting most everything here. Just because it's, uh, boosted by the field and everything. Yeah, th this field is great for, uh, Toxtricity. But yeah, every time you defeat someone, um, one of the things go away, so... Yeah, we'll just need to find people to battle. And, I mean, it's gonna be pretty obvious who to battle. Electabuzz, that's fine. Boom Burst KOs. Toxtricity comes out. I'm just gonna keep Boom Bursting. Oh, it didn't KO. Oh, that almost KO'd us. Shoutout comes out, it's okay, we Boom Burst. I might need to Ether and clear up. So yeah, there goes that. Um, hello. Da, 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 da. This actually might not KO. Okay, never mind. Arbok comes out, it's fine. I'm gonna Boom Burst. I'm gonna Ether up here. So, Ether, I should have a few. 14, yeah, okay. I do know there's one that heals you, I just don't remember where. Oh yeah, there's there's the uh, there's the butterflies right there. So we can use the butterflies to heal up. Um, I'm gonna do that after. Oh wow, you survived. Uh, that was not expected. I'm gonna expand in force here. Relic can. Uh, oh, actually, that's bad. Head smash KOs. I realized that way too late. Um, bulldoze here. And bulldoze again. Okay. Okay, so I think the police officer here is the last Pokemon, but... Ooh, this is getting kind of scary. Light bird. Okay, first impression, easy KOs here. 
Arcanine is a bit more annoying. Uh, we go to Prissy here for sure. We tank anything this thing wants to do. Whirlpool. Yep. And then I'm gonna dive. Yep, it's gonna miss. Nice, perfect. Wow, nothing happened after you defeated that guy. It's possible Alicum's Psyche is too far gone. No more artifacts can be erased. Here's an idea. It's so risky, so bear with me. There's a counter there. You can hop onto the stereo. You should jump on those and, like, ride the crowd. So, yeah, uh, we got a crowd surf. Um, I am going to heal first. And, uh, yeah, I do want to lead. I am going to lead. Uh, actually, no. What I want to do for sure is I want to have Bug Buzz. Do I have Bug Buzz? Yes. Um, I think over expanding force for this one because uh, we need to calm Alakazam down. So we are going to be battling at Alakazam. We have three Pokemon that can hit Alakazam super effectively. Uh, Ampere's there. I might want to nuzzle it, but I'm not sure yet. But yeah, poison type means that I will get one shot by a psychic type move. All right, life is about mistakes. We that worked great, awesome, cool. We need you to calm down, Alakazam. Or well, okay, sounds good. Um, do I lead you though? I think I lead Buzz just to get a uh, light screen up. So yeah, boss battle time. So yeah, uh, two shields. Oh yeah, this is bad. Okay. Oh, it's also gonna light screen. That's not great for me. Nightshade, that's okay. So yeah, uh, I just needed to get in range of a good... Ooh. Okay, I needed to get in range so that I can do an easy... Uh, Nice, okay, okay. I just need... Because first impression KOs. Nice, okay, we win, we win. Light screen fades. Focus blast missed again, perfect. Okay, even if that didn't miss first impression from... Uh, first impression KOs, but yeah, that... That battle can be scary if you don't have the right Pokemon, for sure. Um, just because it automatically just call mines up a couple times makes life a lot harder for you. Um, Another tactic that you can do is uh, Topsy Turvy Malamar actually does fairly well here. Um, Topsy Turvy can reverse the stats and let you set up, and Malamar contrary just lets you set up if you need to. Wake, wake, hey, I said wake up. Oh, huh? It's midnight, club's closed. You guys gotta go home. Forgive us, sir, my friends are just really tired. Gosh, my head. Why? You guys need an ambulance or something? Not recommend, dudes. They will be fine. Well, you guys get your mind together and leave. We gotta close up shop. See ya. Sorry about that, guys. I should have considered the setting before I brought us to that plane. That idol sort of showed up unannounced, so it could not have been a predicted. Still, did you find anything of note? Well, Talon's mom really was here, I think. She was on the stage waiting for Talon, but then Risa's influence in the real world caused Alakazan some headaches. So we found nothing of real substance. No, I'm sorry. It's fine. We tried our best. Let's just go home. It's quite late. Yeah. That was close. They almost actually figured something out. Uh-huh. It's a good thing the real Risa postponed her show here tonight, or else we would have been screwed. But my genius is something that cannot be questioned. B but Cosmia, disguising yourself as Risa was my idea. Shut up, Comet. It was my idea. You can't even transform properly. You up and went and transformed into that nobody NPC, and now you can't turn back. But you know what? That nobody face suits you anyway. But blah, blah, blah. Shut a mouth up. Don't forget I'm doing this for us. If we keep obeying, then we'll be able to uh, be really real forever and ever. So just shut up. Do what I tell you. Oh, Adam. I know you said you weren't into girlies like me, but just wait till you hear my new song. Eh? Eep, eep. Adam closed up early and went home. 
went home. Dang. Okay, thanks for letting me know. La di da, being a girl boss. Too close for comfort. Let's go back home and plan our next scheme. I have a feeling the next one is gonna be good. So yeah, that girl can transform into people. Uh, which, you know, has a lot of implications. Um, but we're gonna end this part here. We finished up our investigation. Uh, actually, wait, let me think about what's next. Uh, yes, we're gonna end this part here. Yes, I remember now. Uh, we're gonna end this part here, um, but we do... We, all you need to do to continue the story is just to head back to the uh, apartment and do all that. Um, and yeah, we finished our two investigations. And next time, we'll continue the story. I'll see you guys then.